just that first step you take in the direction of balance, love, health, whatever you want to call it, God, if you want to get spiritual or mystical or, or theistic, mm -hmm. the moment you take that step, you have joined forces with an ocean of humans who are all on your side, who all want, who are all involved in the same project in different ways. Mm -hmm. And it's an invisible army, but they're out there. And I think you could take some comfort in that, you know, the, like, any given time that you're like, you know, like fucking tomorrow, man, I finally signed up with my goddamn trainer again. I totally fell off the working out wagon. I hurt myself, use that as an excuse to not exercise, gained a bunch of goddamn weight. And now I got to go through the whole fucking thing again, right? <laughs> yep. The whole fucking thing. I got to go meet with him. He's going to look at me like, what the fuck happened? And I've got to go through the whole goddamn thing again. But I take yep. comfort in knowing that when I drive down there to do this shit, and when I go and meet with him, I am one of millions of other fatties who are all making that decision that, God damn it, today I'm going to overcome this fucking entropy. And yep. you know what I mean? I think there's something that I take a lot of comfort in that, knowing that I've become part of this invisible army of people who, even though we may fail, even though mm -hmm. tomorrow night there's a, a high probability that I'm going to have a fucking thick crust of gluten-laden cheese pizza being shoved into my mouth by my traitorous hand at least i'm trying man you know i think that's all that matters. i love it, I love it. no you're right you're absolutely right because that's all you can ask for yourself you know you can't expect perfection you can't expect to be always uh delivering the results you wish but the one thing you can is just try again just get back on your feet and you get knocked down and you get back down your feet i think sometime for me martial arts i notice like whenever i obsess about outcome that's when fear and worries and bad feelings increase it's like what if i don't deliver the way i was what did i don't perform the way i wanted to what if i don't win what if i don't you know that kind of thing whenever instead i forget about outcome and i focus on effort on just going and you know collapse before you give up just give everything you got i don't give a fuck how it's gonna turn out that's out of your hands to some degree you know there's no full way to ensure but what you can ensure is effort is just put your heart and guts into it then yeah. it becomes so much it, it takes away a lot of stress it takes away a lot of that fear of not living up to expectations of what you wish you were because uh, because those expectations are based on usually measurable results, whereas effort is something else entirely. And it's um, and the more you I do that, then the easier it is to get the results I want. And then when I don't, it's not as crushing, because my whole sense of self wasn't wrapped up in the outcome. Right. Yeah. And you know, results are fantastic. Sure. And 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 a, a great reward. But you know, this is I, this is one of my favorite Sharon Salzberg quotes. The healing is in the return. It's mm -hmm. the, the practice is great. The regular daily meditation practice. My God, if the, if the universe has graced you with this, you're so lucky. The yep. Greek God five years into working out. Fuck, what a hero. It's amazing you've done it. But what's equally amazing is the moment that you push yourself out of your entropy and try one more time to pick up your bow and dive back into this incredible jihad that is at this very moment raging all over this planet. And yep. man, it's, it's glorious. It's glorious to, to do it. Just that by itself is incredible. And if you, and if you, if you die on the field of battle, mm -hmm. if you fail, in this endeavor, you're still a million times better than someone who never tried it at all. It's cliche, Absolutely. but it's true.